learning class, today I'm going to give you a review of uh, one of your assignments, the secondary data table. If you'll notice in Blackboard, there are some brief instructions, but of course the complete instructions are in your textbook. Um, one of the things I wanted to go over with you in the textbook, some of the links may no longer be effective for the census.gov website where you will get your, where you will select your statistical abstract from. If that is the case, um, well actually let me show you. If I copy this link here, and of course I'm doing this online so that's one way to copy it, or of course you could type it in. If I were to do that, it actually, let's see, this is presidential elections. This link actually does still work. So it's taking me to um, the Excel or the the Excel data file or the PDF file for the presidential elections. And that one's in the book. So yes, that one does still, still seem to work. Um, on another note, let's see, I think I have it back here. The statistical abstract is located at census.gov, compedia, compendia, c-o-m-p-e-n-d-i-a, backslash, s-t-a-t-a-b. And that is the statistical abstract. Um, as you can see, there's lots of information, tells you about the statistical abstract, uh, where they collect this data from. And then you have all these different categories of data files that you can take a look at. And of course, I strongly suggest select a data file that is similar to the topic that you selected for this class, because that way you'll be gathering more information uh, that will assist you in writing your uh, research paper. So once again, the only change primarily is that some of the links um, may be incorrect, but if you just go to census.gov, compendia, backslash, S-T-A, T-A-B, statistical abstract, and I will, of course, put this updated link for you in Blackboard, you should be able to find all the data that you need. So say if you were looking on for something on family planning or abortions, you would go to birth, deaths, marriages, go to that section, click on it. And there are all these wonderful different data files um, that you can look through. If I click on, let's say, the PDF abortion numbers and rates by race, it will pull up that data. Uh, let's see, here we go. Abortions, number and race rate by race, 1990s, 2007. It looks at all races, excuse me, it looks at the years, it looks at the age of the women, um, it looks at abortions, and it also breaks it down by race, white, black, and other. So, once again, remember, you'll find all this information on census.gov on the statistical abstract. If you have additional questions about Assignment number two, your secondary data tables, please be sure to ask. Thanks for watching and have a great day.